This first video in the construction of the star lift is kind of unique because I had previously filmed some of the other videos and then I had this aha moment where I said, duh, you forgot a step. And the step that I forgot was to glue the launch lug onto the tube because before you can paint the tube, the launch lug has to be applied. Um, and so I'm going to do that now and then we'll go ahead and really start the uh, construction of the rocket in the other videos. So the launch lug is three inches long and we need to cut it in half. So just find the halfway point and then using a very, very sharp hobby knife or a razor blade, uh, we're going to saw through it. And once you get it started, kind of rotate it. And as you can see, my ends are never perfect. Um, so take a little bit of super glue. Um, and I got, I got thin super glue and I got a little applicator tip on it. Just run it on the inside of there on both, on both pieces. Wipe off any excess paper towel. And I got some kicker here to accelerate the uh, reaction. It's called InstaSet, and it just makes super glue dry almost instantaneously. So now my super glue is dry and hard, and what it did is it stiffened up that end. And I'm going to take some medium grit sandpaper and I'm going to sand that flat. See, I'm kind of using a circular motion and rotating it at the same time. And do the other one. Now, unfortunately, it leaves a little burr on the inside, and I got a little file. If you don't have a file, just take a piece of uh, sandpaper and roll it up and then use that just to smooth out the insides because we want that as smooth as possible so that the launch rod, when it goes through there, doesn't bind on anything. Okay, and then we want to glue these onto the body tube. And this is the lower body tube, and you can see these it's got the slots for the fins. And these other slots right here, there's one on the bottom, one on the top, are for the launch lug. Um, and basically, you, you're, we're going to make a little trough. I'll just pop these out. Um, you can leave these other um, little pieces in, and I'll tell you why in just a second. But these are just drop right in there. Oops. They just drop right in and they're going to be glued. And the trough allows, allows the, the, the launch lugs to sit perfectly straight. So that way I don't have to line anything up. And we're just going to glue these in. So I'm just putting some glue. This is just wood glue on the launch lug. And that's probably way too much. And just like that. And do the next one. And this one going on the bottom. Now, if you have a little gap like this one here, uh, which means I didn't cut them exactly in the middle. Um, Try to test fit them first and then make sure that if there's a gap, it's on the one here near the fins instead of up here on the top. And if you got gaps on both of them, um, try to go ahead and fill it with a little glue to kind of seal up that hole. Uh, it's not that critical. Having a, just a very small vent is not bad. Um, 
but if you have a large one, put it on the bottom because um, um, you'll see at the at the uh, bottom of the rocket on this one here, you can see that it's already has a lot of holes in it, so it's already vented up here. But the forward bulkhead seals it off so that it can pressurize and push the rocket forward or push the uh, nose cone off. So the, that little hole here um, is not that critical. So we're going to let that glue dry and then what I'm going to tell you in a future video is uh, we're going to paint the rocket first before we assemble the rest of the rocket before we put the fins on. And to paint the rocket um, you'll need a dowel or some old body tubes um, and basically that makes a holder like this so you can hold the, ro hold the tube while you're painting it. Um, and this is just temporarily glued in here and it's just very little glue and it should snap off easily when you're, when you're done painting. So we're going to prime it and paint it first before we build the rocket. Um, you'll want to put the nose cone on one of the tubes. You can see here I got the launch lugs on. Um, put the nose cone on there so you can do it all at the same time. So you're going to paint all of these items before you assemble the rocket. Um, and you can start that right now uh, before you do anything else.